I was just lying on the beach listening to the waves of the ocean and the chatter around me and I had a smile on my face because one of the things that I really enjoy telling my clients is the magnitude of the power of self-empowerment. What does that mean? That means if you have gone through some type of broken trust and now you are looking at reconciling and rebuilding, take that leap of faith jump all in hook line and sinker why because now you're not starting all over you're not starting from scratch you're starting from experience and number one you have to own the fact that number one both parties have to do the work have to do the consistent work long term number two you have to get to the point where you tell yourself i have to be willing to be hurt again and the reason why is because you cannot come to the reconciliation table all battle suited up. So you have to be open and vulnerable. But number three, you've changed. Your tools have changed. Your knowledge has changed. Your resources have changed. Your boundaries have changed. Your requirements have changed. So you're not starting from where you are. I don't want you to be afraid. Will he do this again? Will she ever do that again? If they're doing the work, probably not. But even if they do, you are empowered now where you make decisions. And next time, if there's a next time, I pray there's not. If they're doing the work, there's a good chance there's not going to be. But if they do, then you up the ante. Okay, now since you did this, now I need this. Or you make the decision you need to leave. Because now, now you know, Maya Angelou said, now that I know better, I do better. A lot of people, a lot of people after broken trust, they now have um, a, a post nup. They now have a signed agreement well, with a notary. They now have an understanding that I'm going to get A, B, and C if you do this again. Um, they now have a low tolerance level, a low BS level. Um, they now demand more respect, more accountability, more transparency, more honesty. I mean, it's a new world. But, but you do have power. You are empowered. So don't think, oh, if I stay, I'm weak. If I forgive them, I'm weak. If I try to rebuild or reconcile, I'm weak. No, no. It's two new people and a brand new relationship. But much more important, it's empowered people. It's determined people, motivated people. It's learned people. You've learned what to, ne what to negotiate, what not to negotiate, your boundaries. Jump all in. Give it a leap of faith. And know that you're no longer that bird relying on the branch, but yet on your wings. Because if that branch ever falls again, you got your wings to keep you afloat.